Hey there everyone, let me share back again with another video. In today's video, we are diving into something super exciting, how to create your own custom GPT. Well, creating the custom GPT feature is only available for paid version of ChatGPT. It is not available for free version of ChatGPT. For example here, this is the free version of ChatGPT. And if you go to the profile, and if you click on my GPTs, and if you can notice here, the create GPT button is disabled. Okay, so this create GPT is only available for paid version of chat GPT. So if I open the paid version of chat GPT over here, so this is a paid version of chat GPT. And if I go to the profile and click on my GPTs, and here you can see create a GPT feature is only available for paid version of GPT. Okay, so if you want to create your own GPT, then you have to upgrade to the paid version of chat GPT. That is GPT plus. Well, before creating the custom GPT step by step, let us first understand what a custom GPT is. Well, a custom GPT is a tolerated version of OpenAPI Chat GPT that you can modify or fine tune for specific tasks. So instead of using a general purpose of Chat GPT, you can create your own version of GPT that is designed for your own unique needs. Okay. For example, here I have already created my own GPTs over here. Spring Framework, Spring Boot and Microservices. So this custom GPT is specific to learning Spring Framework, Spring Boot and Microservices. And here I have created one more custom GPT that is YouTube Video Script Writer. So this custom GPT is specific for writing the YouTube video scripts. Similarly, here I have created few more custom GPTs that satisfy my unique needs. Okay. Now let us go ahead and let us see how to create the custom GPT step by step. So go ahead and click on this create GPT button and here you have two options create and configure you can configure the you know custom GPT from here otherwise you can also tell chat GPT to create the custom GPT for you for example here it is asking what you like to make so let us say I want to make a custom GPT to learn the Python programming so here I'm going to create a custom GPT to learn the Python programming but you can follow the same steps to create a custom GPT for any kind of task. You can use custom GPT for handling your customer support queries. You can create a custom GPT for learning any subject or if you want to create a custom GPT for your cooking. Okay. So here let us ask chat GPT. I want to learn Python programming. Okay, so you can see updating GPT. So let us see what is the response. So you can see here, great, I set up this GPT up as a Python programming tutor. Now let us give it a name. How about Python mentor? Would you like to go with that or do you have another name in mind? So if you are happy with this custom GPT name, you can tell chat GPT that this name is Okay, otherwise if you want to change it, you can ask ChatGPT to change the name. Okay, for example, let us say we want to keep this Python mentor as a name. Then you can ask ChatGPT, give Python mentor as custom GPT name. So notice the preview section over here. Whatever the operation you perform here, that will be reflecting over here. So just you told chat GPT to give Python mentor as a custom GPT name that is what reflected over here. Okay. And chat GPT also created a default, you know, profile uh, picture as well. You can see the logo over here. Okay. So this is how your custom GPT looks like. If you want to customize it, you can again ask to the chat GPT over here. Next, if you want to configure more on this, you can just click on this configure. And you can see the name Python mentor description. So if you want to change the description, you can just change over here. For example, if you want to give the description like this GPT helps user learn Python programming with clear explanations and step by step explanation. Next here instruction. So you can give instruction chat GPT like how chat GPT can respond to your, you know, questions. And here current conversion starters. Next. If you want to upload anything related to 
python programming you can upload from here for example let us say you have a pdf on python programming then you can just upload that file and you can ask question so that chat gpt can you know you know provide the answer from that pdf file as well and the capabilities like web search canvas and this dell e image generator so whatever the capabilities that you want over here that you can you know tick mark over here next create new action next you can create a new action like how this custom gpt acts outside this chat gpt for example you can provide the authentication type by using you know api key or oauth okay next you can provide the additional settings like use conversation data in your gpt to improve our models so if you don't want just untick it okay so this is how you can configure your own custom gpt in chat gpt next in order to create this custom gpt go ahead and click on this create button over here and here you can share the gpt so you can share this gpt with you only or anyone with the link or gpt store so as of now let us select only me and then click on save all right so as soon as you save you will get the link if you want to view the just created custom gpt you can just click on this view gpt and there we go you can see here your custom gpt named python mentor and you can also see this custom gpt over here as well you can see here python mentor so you can access this custom gpt quickly from here as well now you are good to use this custom gpt to learn the python programming so let us say if i say what is python then let us see how this custom gpt responds i notice here this is python definition and this is the features of python okay next let us ask python teach me to learn python programming step by step step by step and let us see the response of this custom gpt look at here it is producing the step by step process step one step two like that okay so now we have created a custom gpt specific to learning the python programming similarly you can create a custom gpt for your own needs like if you want to create a custom gpt for handling the customer support in your website you can go ahead and create the custom gpt like this if you are a student you can create a custom gpt for your subjects for example data structures or history related subjects or the physics maths okay so this feature is awesome so if you want to create a custom gpt for a specific topic then you can go ahead and create the custom gpt like this okay next if you want to manage the custom gpts go to the profiles and click click on this my gpts and from here you can manage your custom gpts for example if you want to edit it you can click on this edit button and you can update the you know custom chat gpt from here next if you want to delete you can just click on these three dots and just click on this delete gpt to delete the custom gpt for example let me delete this untitled custom gpt from here like this all right so this is all about creating custom gpt in a chat gpt all right great i will see you in the next video